Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Stage Zero Life Sciences a channel on a mission to help reduce the incidence of late stage cancer through early intervention. Uh, joining us to discuss, we have James, who's going to take us over the uh, high level overview of the growth strategy here between clinics. We're going to talk about partnering with labs uh, and, of course, even getting into uh, toxic workplaces and just what their project uh, and their treatments like Aristotle uh, mean currently for the business moving forward. James, the Chief Executive Officer, first and foremost, welcome, sir. Thank you. It was a pleasure to get you back on. So I think what's really uh, pivotal here is you guys are at this phase now of scale, kind of done all the hard work now, and it's just kind of getting it out there. And I wouldn't mind first and foremost talking about the clinics. This is something that I'm actually personally intrigued by because I was kind of getting early cancer prevention and knowing what you're kind of inclined to have in the future to just give to your, your doctors and just kind of be aware of, I think is super pivotal. I mean, you're in 15, 16 cities for clinics in the US, major cities. Uh, you're expanding here in Canada, you're Toronto. Across Canada, Calgary, the Maritimes. We want to talk about the lab expansion first and foremost, and what that looks like here. I guess more or less in the Western world, and maybe even globally. Yes. Um, so I think one one of the most frequent questions we get is, you know, what does our partnering efforts look like? Are we doing this alone? Are we partnering with a lot of groups? And then, if we are partnering, how does it work? How long does it take? What kind of results will it give at the end of the day? And so I think if we break that up and we start looking at it. So, so one, let's start with the view that we're a single group. It's a single voice into the marketplace. We have a certain amount of reach um, of necessity um, that is always relatively limited. If we now begin to partner with a whole series of groups, and so, for example, literally over the last um, few weeks, um, last couple of weeks, in actual fact, we've now um, sort of increased the number of clinics that we have in Toronto, in the GTA. What is nice is that's right downtown. It helps with the firefighter effort, but it also means that we now have a clinic or a group of clinics actively promoting our products into their patient population. When they get positives, they also refer up, for example, into the other relationships that we built. So, for example, Women's College Hospital, Mount Sinai, all of that builds. Now move it down south. We've done the same in terms of Calgary. We've done the same in terms of building out into Vancouver. From there, let's take a city like L.A. Um, we've been in L.A. for a while. While we build out in all of that, the more venues that we have, the better. And so the more clinics we actually bring on board that work with us in that way, the better it is. They take us into their patient populations. They take us into their relationships with employers. Um, they offer the test right on the ground. And so you build and you build. I think the other thing with this is um, when we begin to work with employers, um, we're getting as much um, traction on avert on the preventative program, the longer term preventative program, as we're actually getting on Aristotle. It's very interesting in that, and that is because as we've talked about before, we're the one group that does the end-to-end -end solution. Remember, avert is preventive. Aristotle is, do you have cancer today? Likely, yes or no. Avert is the preventative aspect. And when you deal with employers, that's critical. When you deal with insurers, that's critical. Um, so we go with that. Now expand it out. Um, so, for example, let's look at working with a whole series of labs. I think we mentioned the fact that we're in sort of 15 or 16 of the major U.S. cities. We're in a lot more than that in terms of the smaller ones, but let, let's focus on that. So, again, go from us being single group, go to us working with the lab group that could have 50 outlets across the country, could have 100, could have 150. What you do is you put those relationships in place. They're now taking you into this. So what if they have access to 100 million um, U.S. Patients. What if they have a population base? What if they have employers that they deal with? It's an automatic entry into all of that. Additionally, what we do is we bring a very a set of very innovative programs that take us into a whole series of areas. And again, I'll reinforce um, avert is equally as important as Aristotle in this. You also get the stickiness. Remember Aristotle's single test, avert. You come back once a quarter. If you test positive, a significant number of the patients will test positive. So you get the higher revenue, you get the ongoing stickiness, patients stay with us a long period of time. So that's what we're building. And it's already, a lot of it's already in place. It's building out. Um, I think everyone's looking for this massive announcement from us. Typically it doesn't happen that way. Um, it'll come in pieces. A lot of it's in place before it actually begins to get announced. Um, because that's just the mechanics of how it happens. But that's how we build and grow.
So it seems like everything that you guys are doing is very modular, scalable. And when it kind of comes to this preventative, you know, cancer uh, idea of treatment, I think it's really intriguing from the value standpoint of say businesses that require like recovering health insurance and, you know, especially in places maybe like firefighters, people that are really exposed to toxic environments and kind of saving that long winded cost and that track of going through chemo or kind of getting all those treatments. Do you want to talk about, does that come in partnering with the labs or how does that look like from a conversation standpoint? Yeah, it, it, it involves labs and clinics, so so it's all together. I mean, one of, one of the things I think people have got used to with us is we're very strategic. We don't just do stuff. It, there's always a very clear strategy behind it. And so think about it. We, we have the test. We have Aristotle. We also have a vert. We also have the system in the middle through the clinic that actually ties it, so the care oncology clinic that ties it together. So now we go on out and let, let's go to a toxic workplace in terms of where it is. One, um, you know, if we've got to go and find all of those workplaces on our own, we can, but it's going to take us a significant amount of time. If we have 10 or 15 or 100 partners out there actually doing that with us, they're walking us into their, or their ready set relationships. And so what we can do is we can take it in and add. Now, what you do at the end of the day, you need clinics to actually handle the patients running through. So clinics play into it, but you actually also need the labs because the labs are actually going to do the draws. The labs may have the patient base in terms of where it is. So you walk in and there's a lot of very innovative stuff in the preventative health market really starting to open up at the moment. So, so we're, we're actually, and we keep talking about this, but we truly are. We are uniquely positioned to do this. Yes, people want to see results. Yeah, we want to see results. They're coming. It's a matter of building it. But we don't want people to sit there and go, oh, okay, you haven't announced that you're doing this thing, so therefore, you know, it, it's not working. No, it's working. It, it, it's going step by step. Um, you'll see the results as it comes through. Well, on that note, I'll pass the question off to the viewers. We'd love to know what you think in that comment section below. And definitely consider subscribing because as Catalyst News continue to hit the wire, we're going to update you here. But on that, as always, we look forward to catching you in the next one.